All right, so I'm going to adjust the way that my iTunes uh, viewing options are actually set. And I'm going to start with my sidebar. Now, I can adjust the size of my sidebar by clicking and dragging on the division between my sidebar and this main window. When I roll over it, you'll notice my cursor changes to this icon, and I can click, hold it, and drag to adjust size. My library where I can see my music, movies, TV shows, and so forth, can also be edited. Let's say, for example, I never use the radio. All I need to do is go to iTunes, Preferences, and remove radio from this list. Notice it says Show, and then it lists all my different libraries. I'll hit OK. And when I come back here, radio is now gone. In my main window, I can adjust each column the same way I can adjust the width of the, the sidebar just by clicking and dragging in between each of the columns. Real easy. I can also adjust the order in which these columns appear by clicking and dragging the header. Now you'll notice that I have a scroll bar here in the, that goes horizontally and I can see all the columns that might be hidden if my iTunes is a little bit too small. So I'm going to expand that by clicking and dragging on the bottom right hand corner. There we go. Now we can see all the columns. Now there might be some columns here that you might not want and there might be some that you want but do not have. So let's say for example I want to add a column that shows me the year the song was created. I can right click on this header anywhere I want that column to appear. So let's say I want the year of the song to appear right here. I'll right or control click and then select year. And it will appear exactly where I clicked. And you'll notice that this song, for example, was created in 2001. Pretty easy. Now there's another way to add and subtract columns, and that would be by going to your view options under view view options or selecting command J and I can remove and add columns as I like. So for example if I want one for beats per minute I can hit OK and I'll notice here's one for beats per minute or BPM. Alright so that is how I adjust my viewing options in my main window and how I will edit out my library.